Can you imagine that? The Incredible Hulk and the Falcon? Come on, man. That's, that's game over. Found those bad guys you were talking about. You okay? I'm not dead yet. Welcome to Miami. I'm here in Miami with no other than Anthony Mackie, yes, aka the Falcon. How's what? it going? How's it going? We Good to see you. Before, but let's, let's I know. Good. Mama, little hands. I like it. So we're here talking about Captain America, the Winter Soldier, and you are now part of the Marvel Universe, my yes, friend. Yes, How it does was, that feel like? It's a dream come true. Uh, I, I asked over and over again for about five years to be a part of the Marvel Universe, and they said no, no, no. And finally they gave in and said yes, and it worked out perfectly, I think. Were they like, please stop emailing us? They, they really were. It was very impressive. They said, don't call us ever again. We'll call you. Okay. And, uh, <laughs> and uh, a year later, I get a call. They fly me out to L.A., and they said, we want you to be the Falcon. And well, I for said, five years, you were Hell knocking yeah. on their door. That was what it. were you thinking? What uh, was the superhero in mind? <clears throat> I, was, I wanted to be, they, they have uh, Luke Cage, they have Black Panther, who I was kind of targeting, who I thought would be great uh, on the big screen because of the success of Blade and uh, Spawn. But, uh, you know, the Falcon is such an iconic role, and I felt like he was so different than everybody else that uh, when it came up, I was very happy that it was the Falcon. You kind of look like a panther. Give me yeah, your best yeah, a little panther bit of, pose. Right. Ah, How about that? Very nice. So let's talk about these massive robotic wings. Arms? How was oh. I was like, no, the no. <laughs> I felt them. I mean, they're here. It's really, it gets weird really fast. <laughs> <laughs> How are those wings like? Were they heavy? How was uh, that like? Not at all. Actually, I'm glad you didn't know. The wings are 100% CGI. I didn't know that. They, uh, we had the battery pack. We had the full costume. But the wings on set were actually like two and a half foot pigeon wings that they would s literally stick on my back and I would run around with little wings on. Pretty embarrassing. It looked right? like a pheasant. I was more like a quail than a falcon. <laughs> and, um, you know, in CGI, they just expanded them and made them look real. How was it like pretending to fly? Because I heard you tried to do one of your stunts and you Didn't ended up well. just, not into yeah. like a buggy, but into yeah. like a bus. Full bus. Ouch. Full How bus. was that? Uh, didn't go well, but it was great. It was a lot of fun. You did. You never realize how out of shape you are until you try to do. No, trust me. Until you try to do something that requires just muscle, muscular discipline, uh -huh. and it, it hurts really bad. I mean, and we've seen you be funny. We've seen you be serious. We always see him muscular. I mean, no. always. No, um, I was I was very upset with this movie because I was in the best shape I've been since I was 18. Uh -huh. So I thought superhero spandex. They kind of go hand in hand. Of course. You know, but they told me no spandex. So it was a monumental thing. You were fail. looking forward to those spandex. So much spandex. So were we. So much spandex. Uh, so much, no. You, right, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> so another Captain America sequel is planned. And funny enough, you're going to be, you guys are going to be headed with Batman and Superman. Yes, yes. I mean, it's set to debut the same freaking weekend. Yeah. What do you think about that massive um, showdown? Well, Ben Affleck's a good friend of mine. We've done a movie together. Um, he's a very talented director and actor. And uh, I think Captain America 3 is going to be a very good movie. <laughs> good find. And then you're also in the next Avengers movie, Age of... Uh, Yolton, what can you tell us about your role? I'm not sure if I'm in it yet. Oh, come on. I'm, I'm not. I'm, Marvel hasn't told me anything. They're shoot, they start shooting in about a week. So wait, wait, they haven't told you anything? They haven't told me anything. Week? But, I mean, look at this. It took <laughs> me five years to find out right. about this. So I'm hope, I'm, I left my summer open, and I told them if they needed me, I'm I could be in London right. in eight hours. That's all I need is eight hours. That's it. So, but they haven't told me anything yet, so I'm hoping that somebody will break an ankle or something <laughs> and they'll plug me in. All right, and if you're going to part, be part of another dynamic duo, other than Captain America, who would be your choice? Incredible Hulk. Of course. Can you imagine that? The Incredible Hulk and the Falcon? Come on, man. That's, that's game over. Or I think Iron Man's just too flashy for me. I think, you know... The Falcon is kind of a reserved, kind of cool guy. So you look at the Incredible Hulk, I think we could smash a lot together. Smash. Smash. Hulk hand. Oh, see what I'm saying? You nice. could be like a little Hulkstress. Mini Hulk. <laughs>